Hi, I'm Casey and I have a crush on food. And today, I'm feeling a little naughty. Doesn't happen very often in the kitchen, but it's happening today. I'm going to show you how to make a raspberry liqueur that's great for gifts. I do it all the time at Christmas and people love it. They beg for it. So, it's really simple. The limiting step is going to be just thawing the raspberries. So you're going to need two 10 ounce packages of frozen raspberries and you're going to let them thaw in a colander and I just put a big glass bowl under the colander so that the juice collects in the bowl. So whatever comes out from the thawed raspberries you're going to transfer to a saucepan which I have right here. And it's in there, it looks beautiful. And we're just going to heat the juice with one and a half cups of sugar. and half of a sliced lemon. So all we really want is for this to uh, come to a boil and for the sugar to dissolve. So it doesn't take very long, just kind of stir it frequently. You don't want the sugar to burn. So I'm going to let my, um, my liquid heat up and the sugar dissolve. All right, so my mixture started to boil a little bit, and you can tell when the sugar's dissolved because you won't feel the granules. It'll feel real nice and smooth, and your liquid will be nice and um, smooth and thick. So I'm going to turn the heat off and take it off, and then we're going to add the exciting part. Okay, so I have my pan here, and I'm just going to take out the lemon slices. And there's going to be a little bit of a film on top, so you can just use the spoon to kind of skim the top of the syrup just to get the film off. And, I mean, you don't have to get all of it off, all of the film off, you can see. It just kind of, like... So just use your spoon and get as much as you can. Okay. So next we're going to add the raspberries um, and the vodka. I have one and a half cups of vodka here. So just pour that in. Use a decent vodka because you're not... Um, uh, it's going to really have the flavor of the vodka, so you want it to be nice. Um, and then just put your raspberries in here. And I like to put them in nice jars for people. Um, I've put them in very decorative bottles. Sometimes I put them in, you know, washed, like a washed uh, jelly jar or a washed pickle jar. So it's up to you. Um, you can make it look cute, even if it's a pickle jar. And then you're just going to pour the liquid and the raspberries in the jar. And the thing about this is it needs to be stored in the refrigerator for four weeks before you can consume it. So once a week, you will kind of give it a shake. Uh, in the jar or whatever bottle you have it in and um, after four weeks then you can you can put it on ice cream which is what a lot of people do um, you can pour it on maybe some cream puffs you can even drink it you can strain the raspberries out and you can drink it if you want to but just make sure if you are giving it as a gift and it hasn't been in the refrigerator for four weeks that that is what you need to do. So, I'm making a raspberry vodka mess here. But you kind of get the idea. Put it on. Put a bow on it or something. Make it look nice. But you have an easy homemade gift for somebody that they'll be able to enjoy for a long time. So, I hope you try my raspberry liqueur and people love it.